And of course, has a long and storied history with the sea. And nowhere is that history more tangible than at the Maine Maritime Museum. The museum just got a $160,000 grant to help make its 9,000 documents and artifacts more accessible to everyone. New Center Maine photojournalist Sebastian Benage dropped anchor at the museum today to find out more about it. There's about 9,000 objects just in this room. Sea chests, furniture, telescopes. As a younger institution, we collected a lot of stuff and we didn't have enough staff to properly sit down and research and document everything about these collections. So for decades, the information about these things has gone unrecorded. With this grant that we got, we are thoroughly documenting our collections. We're writing better descriptions of them, better histories. The grant is through the Institute for Museum and Library Services. We got $160,000, and most of that money goes towards the full-time employment of two collection specialists. In the database records that are accessible to the public, as soon as any updates are made to those records, they're immediately available. Internally, we share images of our collections. So if someone on staff said, do you have any paintings or prints that show a winter scene? Now, with this project, they will more easily be able to find that information on their own instead of go through the shelves and touch things and handle things because human error is how things get damaged. And the more handling, the more likely that is to happen. And this is a bright red boat. I think a lot of people do not understand that maritime history isn't just boats and sailors and captains. Our collections cover, you know, globalization. They cover cultural identity. A lot of what makes Maine, Maine. So in doing this work, we'll be able to show that more effectively.